So I've been toying with the idea of making a video like this for a little while. As it's the done thing these days for a YouTuber to do X months favourites, I thought I'd have a go at doing one of these videos, but I want to do mine a bit differently for two main reasons. The first being, most of the favourites that YouTubers talk about are things that you purchase. We live in such a materialistic world these days, it kind of frustrates me a lot of the time, a lot of YouTubers videos kind of seem like adverts for shit they want you to buy, which, like, fair play, I know a lot of people all like watching that, and that's fine. I'm not saying that they shouldn't, but it's not really something that fully appeals to me, per se. The other reason, the second reason, is that I don't really buy much. Most of my money gets spent on doing things rather than buying things. Obviously I can't recommend you do things that's a very local base, so instead my favourites are going to be things that are free or available for free in some way. They're going to be kind of either print or publications or music or film or TV. So without chatting on any further, my first favourite has to be Paper Tiger's new EP, In Other Words. Most of you watching probably won't know who Paper Tiger is. He's from a, a hip-hop collective called Doomtree, who are from Minnesota. In Other Words is an excellent EP he's released. It's just the most serene, lovely, kind of ambient electronic music. If you like kind of chilled out electronic music, then you'll definitely love um, his EP. It's available to listen to on Bandcamp for free. We can download it. Second of my April favourites is Original Gravity. This is only going to appeal to some people, um, I'm not going to lie, but probably haven't talked about it very much on this channel before, but I'm a pretty big beer nerd. Original Gravity is a magazine that talks about um, craft beer and real ale in the UK and across the world, but focusing on the UK mostly. And it's a, it's a great magazine. Um, it's free, you can pick it up in selected pubs if you drink in like uh, I got this one in the rake which is um, like next to Borough Market yeah they're always free but you can also read it online it's also like a an, what the fuck do they call them like a an e-paper I don't know what you call it um, and it's really great it's got uh, features on different breweries in the UK it talks about like sour beer styles for instance this month which is really cool another thing I think is awesome which I hope they include more of although I don't know that they will is um, beer recipes. Fucking cool. I'm definitely going to have a go at the coffee stout pancakes. So yeah, Original Gravity. Read it online, pick it up in a pub somewhere. And my third and final thing, kind of tip of the month, is a documentary that was shown on BBC. And it's a new Louis Theroux documentary. I know he's got some other stuff in the pipeline at the moment. But this one focuses on uh, alcoholism in the UK. Specifically, kind of focuses on London. And... It's, it's a really great insight into, well, actually it's a pretty scary insight into the damage that alcoholism can do to people. It's not an easy thing to watch, but it's certainly interesting. And certainly from my profession, I deal with a lot of people who have alcohol problems, and it gave a bit of an insight into the reason why people with alcohol problems struggle to deal with those problems. So yeah, Louis Theroux's um, documentary, I can't remember the name of it, but I'll pick it up on the screen now. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed my April favourites. Comment below if you've kind of enjoyed any of the things I said I've talked about or if you've got anything else that you enjoyed this month. And uh, yeah, I'll see you next time.